What's up, y'all? Got a film of the feed, so let's get into this tea. I'm waiting on the hurricane, girl. It ain't coming fast enough. I don't want it to come at all, but I'm not about to keep waiting. Uh, Brittany dropped her video, so we about to get into it. One, one, one in the chat. Uh, I'm sorry I'm not live with y'all, but I love y'all. Okay, let's get into it. And I need y'all to watch my videos so I can get my own apartment. Right now, <laughs> I don't want to have another kid. I just want to just have just me and my son be free, be happy, travel with my son, and call it what it is. I don't want to have to deal with no dude. I don't want nobody bothering me. I just want to be alone. Well, y'all seen that tip question is. Somebody said, how are you guys adjusting to it being just you two? It's not just us. Damn children. Damn children. How has co-parenting been going? I don't know. Seems like we always co-parent. It's no different. Somebody said, were y'all only together for Wuwa? You are the guest on the show. Why, why you look like that? And we only, uh, you gotta answer that. I'm not gonna change my answer because of what you said. Um, I feel like when I first came here, it was for Wuwa, for us both to be able to be around Wuwa. Mm -hmm. Then I feel like in the long run, with us being around each other a lot, mm -hmm. it made us try to like try out a relationship and. Now we're here. We just got our keys. We just got our keys. We just. They never liked each other. Sound like to me. I, I got that already. He was just uh, some sperm and she was an egg. Got our keys. Women a little more than eggs. She was the body holder, the, the whatever. Y'all know what I'm talking about. What's up, YouTube? Bitch, you got Brittany, and I am back with another video. Hey. Could you guys believe that it's been eight full months, but we're still talking about it like it's just been two days or something? The situation is crazy. But I'm just here to speak my piece to get this over and done with. So this could be the last time speaking on this uh -huh. and we can call it what it is. We sure ready for y'all to call it too. I'm over it. All I'm going to say is uh -huh. I am single. As uh -huh. I've told y'all, I have been single since January 24th. It is September 26th. There is no reason I should still be getting inboxes, comments, texts anything pertaining to my old situation when i moved out the person has moved on and at the end of the day i still have to communicate with this person and this person still has to communicate with me why because we have a beautiful child involved and that is the only reason why we have to communicate lord knows no matter how much I love my son, I do wish that I could have walked away from that situation without having a kid attached to it. Damn. I'm not saying that I regret my son. Because I love my son to death. But if I could have walked away from that situation without a kid, it would have been the best thing in the world. But that is not what happened. That wasn't in God's plan. So yes, we have a kid connected to the both of us. And the only thing that I'm worried about is if my kid is happy, which he is. Sometimes my son has his days where he's like, oh, I wish you and my dad were still together. But then I have to reassure him that things are better without me and his dad being together. So with this video, I just want everybody to know like, I'm happy. I don't know what's going on with nobody else. I just know what's going on with me. I'm right. happy. I'm doing what I have to do to take care of my son. I know a lot of people be writing me like, oh, you should go back to Michigan. You should move to a different state. For right now, the best thing for me to do was to stay in California because 
I wanted my son to be close to both parents. And that is it. Maybe next year I'll move to a different state. Maybe in a couple of years I'll move to a different state. Hell, who knows? Maybe I get to the point where I break my lease here and move to a different state. Right now, I am just doing what's best for my son because my son is the only person that matters in this situation. My son is the only person that I care about in this situation. She know how much her son love Dub, too. He love his daddy, like... And unfortunately, sometimes we got to make those sacrifices. But to be honest, if you ready to ride out, especially if it was to a point that I couldn't afford it, I'm out of here. And that's it. I am solely in California for my son. And that was the whole purpose of me coming to California was for my son. Even though things went further than what they were supposed to go, I solely moved to California for my son. When it was time for me to move to California, I was not going to move here to California because that this is not where I wanted to be at. And even though I made the the decision, the, 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 even though I made the decision to come here, yes, I regret moving here. I regret coming here. And I Damn. know a lot of y'all probably like, well, your life is better this than third. No, it's not. I lived a perfectly good life when I lived in Michigan. Even though I love doing YouTube, I love my supporters, don't get me wrong. But my life was way more stress-free. I didn't have to deal with the stuff that I'm dealing with now. So, yes, if I could go back in time, I would have never moved here. Damn. But what can we do now? All I, wanted, all I want out of this video is for people to stop bringing up my baby daddy. I want people to stop bringing up anything or anybody that y'all don't see me with. If y'all don't see me with somebody, please stop bringing them up in my comments. If y'all know that I don't talk to them no more, stop bringing them up in my comments. Stop writing me about them. Stop writing them about me. Please stop making this. It's not happening. They probably gonna start writing you more. Seem like everything is about me. Me and that person, the only thing that's keeping us this- She can't even say his name. Like, what is it? What happened? Close to each other is the kid that's in the middle. Without that kid, Y'all wouldn't even be bringing our names up with, with each other no more. But it's really annoying. Like, every day I wake up, I get on the internet, and it's just hella messages, hella comments. It's just so much for no reason. Like, it's dead. The situation is dead. The situation has been dead. And it's going to stay dead. So for all y'all right now, Damn. Awesome. oh, this is just something that y'all need. Y'all gonna bounce back. No, we're not bouncing back. I don't want to be back in a relationship. Ain't no bounce. She don't want to get bounced back. I'm closing that chapter of my life. Right now, I am writing a new book in my life. But every time I get to a new page in this book, it's like y'all flip the pages back to go back to the old book. We are trying to move forward in a new book, and y'all keep going backwards in the old book. Y'all have to close that book. Leave it where it's at. She didn't even address him. Damn. Throw it away, burn it, and just move on. <laughs> but I just wanted to come on here just to clear my side. I'm not coming on here to bash nobody, none of that, because what what, what we gonna do, go video for video? I'm not doing that. All I want y'all to know is I'm happy, we are happy. I'm good. Ooh, I'm good, and we're going to be good. I stayed in L.A. because I knew I could afford it. When I applied for this apartment, I paid my own down deposit. So, for all of y'all that's saying, oh, such such take care of you, nobody takes care of me. Well. Does he help? Yes. He sends me money monthly, but it's not the amount that my rent is. But, yes, he does help me with his son which I greatly appreciate. That's one thing that I can say that I appreciate from him. But other than that, anything else that I do for myself or y'all see me doing, it's because I did it. But I'm not gonna keep talking about this situation. I'm just here to let y'all know this is the last video that y'all will see on my channel referring to anything with this situation. But anyways, thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.
like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Girl, she just created a whole new room for questions that people are gonna want answers to. And I just really hate that she did that. Uh, the way your baby daddy can not want to speak to your name is worrying, I don't know. Anyway, I truly dislike your baby daddy. Have a good day. You gotta realize it's a control thing. They really want you to expose something so they can have a real issue. You need to move as far away as possible. Brittany didn't do nothing wrong by laughing at the comment. Better than me because they can do what they want and treat you bad, but you can't get your lick back. What is she getting a lick back for? I'm done with this dude. Okay. Um, this ain't enough. This ain't enough for me. I, I don't even know what to say. My ear is hurt. Damn. I don't even know what to say. It just started, by the way. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and head on out. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, y'all.